This is our retrograde motion demo. It consists of two turntables that are set up on a gearing system that allows the central table to spin at a faster speed than the outer table. Attached to the inner table, we have a light bulb that is counterbalanced by a mass. And this light bulb will represent Earth. And on the outer table, we have a ping pong ball that represents a planet that is further from the sun in our orbit than we are here at Earth. When the light bulb is on, it will cast a shadow of the planet that is further from us onto our wall where we will be able to observe the motion of this planet just like we can observe the motion of other planets within our sky outside. As I turn this and the orbit of Earth gets close to and overtakes the orbit of the outer planet, retrograde motion is observed. And retrograde motion is just the apparent backwards motion of a planet in our sky. If I go ahead and turn on the light, you see the shadow that is represented by the ping pong ball. And you notice that as the Earth travels around, that the position of this planet in its orbit will easily be seen on our screen. Um, this setup has an adjustability for the position of the outer planet in relation to the Earth. To give you an idea of how retrograde motion differs for a planet that is closer to us, such as Mars, versus a planet that's further from the Sun from us, such as Jupiter. You see the planet traveling across our sky. We get close to the same point in our orbit. It starts to go backwards. As we pass it, it continues on. So let's go ahead and see that at a faster rate.